hello everyone welcome back to the channel guys we're talking about these kindred relationships that are in separation and the current energies of it i want to thank you guys so much and welcome you new subscribers if you haven't subscribed i'd appreciate you doing so it really helps the channel out as well as i want to thank you for all your likes and your comments that you guys leave me daily it's truly appreciated let's find out what is the current energy of these soulmates in separation what's going on current energy of these soulmates in separation the old magic trick hey eh? time hmm. you're fully completed your cycle you're in complete alignment with the universe Hmm. you're being risen up like phoenix from the ashes hmm. this person is getting some knowledge about something lessons learned what's this hmm Hmm. Learning something. What the hell is this all about? There could be a child involved or somebody manipulating about a child. You've said a farewell. It's like you're not being part of a three ring circus here. So this one is fake. Yes, they are. They're a wannabe. This person keeps remembering the words you told them. Here you are, complete, stable. You could be remembering your childhood fondly. You know, these are nice memories. Oh. Damn. Moving forward. Stepping in your divine feminine energy. And it's about timing. You've taken control. Ooh. Devil. Mmm. Hmm. Pretender, you broke free. Working on your creative projects. Mm. So this is twin energy. This person is Carrying the weight of the world here. Trying to do a balancing act. Hmm. There's craft work here. This is destiny. You know what? That's that partnership that the universe put together since another lifetime. It was supposed to be rebirthed in this life, but somebody got over there doing some kind of craft work. Lady Luck has shines on you. The door to opportunity and abundance is being opened to you. Mm. There's the 11. Harmony. Hmm. Yeah. That old enticer over there. 
You're regenerating. This person can't get you off their mind. Hmm. Yeah. Pulling the wool over their eyes. That's what they were doing. You let them go. Spell work. Craft work. Yep. You're pure. Taking your power back. Good luck to you over there, evil queen. Messing with Cinderella here. Hmm. This wolf looking at this evil queen. Hmm. I just see you free. I do, I see, yeah, see, evil queen casting a dark spell against who, you, but also this person. What's going on? Dark attachments. You followed your intuition. Hmm. Hmm. Yeah, no happiness there. Yin and yang over here. Well, that's where they were supposed to be. Yeah, the choice that they made, there's no happiness there. It was an evil queen casting spells. I mean... That's why they're going through a, a storm. It's all based upon deceit. This person is on a breakup with that person. You're sitting over here. Yeah, they tried to keep them trapped for money, but you've walked away. You know what I mean? Spirit told this person to walk away. This is a journey, man. I just see you on top of your game here. You're, you're on top of the world, headed in a positive direction. Blossoming, abundant. Bringing your ideas to life. See? The abundant universe providing for you. It's time for a deep dive, you know, going deeper. You can overcome any obstacle. Dove spirit here initiating some kind of peace. What's going on? Trust in the spirit has your back <clears throat> yeah sometimes life stings here but spirit has your back you bring a gentle touch you're laying a solid foundation this person has a beginner's mind Time to collaborate. Life is a mystery. Use your mind wisely. So this person <clears throat> was not. What about these um, soulmates that are in separation? 
financial changes. No wish fulfillment. Trust, spirit has your back. You're celebrating and rejoicing. And I think that this person wants to talk to you, is hoping. They've had to confront their shadow. Seeing you abundant, look at you. Yeah, intuition, choose wisely. You've transformed, made a wise choice, see? They want to restart something with you. They're going through all these challenges and obstacles, trying to heal. What's going on? Yeah, tower after tower, trapped in fear. Be patient. This has been a waiting game. What's going on? Solid foundation. You're trusting your intuition. This person is trying to rejuvenate and heal to build a solid foundation with you. They want harmony. They want to come back together with you and build a solid foundation. Want a victory and a success with you. Recognition and rewards given out. What's going on? Current energy of the collective, the soulmates in separation. Oh. Oh. Heavy burdens with this karmic energy. Tower. Clarified by the tower. Jeez, the past wanting to have justice here an opportunity at, at happiness they're heavily burdened with this tower mm, insincere unloyal not grounded poor choice that they made get the consequences of dealing with the devil Closing off that chapter and wanting a new beginning. Reaping what they've sown. Trying to give you some type of oh, an apology for causing this foundation. That's so unstable. You know your value, your worth. That was a greedy lover. It was out of greed. Tried to keep them stuck there. They got the truth. Something about a child and love. Okay, they've gotten the truth in the clarity. They've learned something. They are out of there. Thought. It was wish fulfillment. They juggled you. Now they're regretting it. Tried, fell for a trap. Now they're the karmic self-sabotaged anyway. Too greedy. All about themselves. This person, there's no communication. They're not doing it. They're in love with someone else. They want the Wheel of Fortune want to new cycle with the queen of wands they're in love with you they're just weak but they're separating they've ended that situation they're getting strong they're quite they want their soulmate back it's that clear learned a lesson well, they're no longer indecisive. <laughs> they know where their Ten of Cups lays. High Priestess is here. Mm. Doing a lot of thinking about equal reciprocity. How do I balance the scales? They've rejected that karmic. They've turned their back. And waiting for their star. How am I going to heal this? How am I going to get my star back? How am I going to get my destined partner back? The Emperor. Wishing and hoping for the Empress. A 
how am I going to heal this with my destined partner? How am I going to restart this? Yeah, they stood their ground. They want this commitment. <clears throat> They're going to fight for this. King of Wands wants to tell you the truth. They're, they've been wounded, but they know this is their judgment for manipulating. The... <laughs> yeah, they took a risk. They were walking away from the karmic. Want to work on a victory. I don't know. See, they thought they were going to be victorious with this energy, but it was all a sneaky little game that they were playing. That's the decision they made. They want to work on this. Become, yeah, see? It was for financial wealth, and they're pissed off because it was all a deception. They were dealing with a damn page who was keeping secrets. Now this person wants to come back in and offer you something balanced. Wants to express something to you. I think they want to pull those swords out and heal this situation with you. That's what this reading is saying, guys. Those of you that know you're not involving a past person, then you know it's not for you. Others of you, <clears throat> there's someone new coming in, so it's going to be your choice, your decision. Spirit's not going to hold you to anything because this person broke the contract. But it is saying they want you back and they are planning on a return. So take that as it resonates, guys. The past wants to return. If you're not open to it, you're not open to it. It's that simple. But it's letting you know they're they're going through a tower. They're dealing with someone very evil, un, unstable, untrustworthy, insincere. Tried to trap them and they freed themselves. From what I'm getting, they are not with the karmic energy, at least in my reads. They're the hermit. They're alone. Soul searching. Trying to figure it all out. And they are learning. They're not happy. With an evil witch doing dark spells, give me a break. The evil queen doing dark spells. You know what I mean? Whether you take them back or not, they're not happy with their situation, I can assure you. You've stood in your power, you've stood in your truth, and that's all that you need to worry about. The universe has your back. It's not going to have the back of this karmic no matter how much craft work they do i find it interesting that this karmic energy is trying to imitate you and they look foolish doing it they keep remembering the words that you spoke to them and they're going you know damn <laughs> the collective was right every word you spoke to this person you spoke the truth everything you said has come true and this person is like they're out of there huh, deal with somebody doing evil spells your whole life what kind of relationship is that going to be you know what I mean this person knows what they did was wrong it's on them and you're under no obligation to return. Absolutely none. Each person's journey is different. And each person's, you know, I just see you on top of the world. Headed in a totally different direction. 
That's what I see. You know, a lot of you don't want to return. Totally understandable. And if you're going forward, a lot of you are choosing to remain single. A lot of you are choosing new love. And it'll be this person's own damn fault. Take care.